DWAC, the stock of Donald Trump. It was his next big idea, Truth Social. It was going to be the next Instagram. The hype around the new idea of Donald Trump grew. The day the stock went public, it went crazy. There were many people that believed in Donald Trump. DWAC rose from its IPO price of $10 to a high of $175 the next day. Let's watch DWAC over 120. Added at 120 on DWAC. Taking some profit. If it halts, watching, buying the warrants. Watching for the warrants on DWAC. I'm long the warrants. And we're looking for the warrants to squeeze up because the halt. DWAC is going to halt. DWAC warrants will not halt. What is going on with this Trump SPAC DWAC? Comes at 10 bucks, goes 140, down to 90, 45 million volume. Ichi wawa caramba, that's crazy. Adding on the warrants right here on DWAC. There's 50 on the ass. The warrants don't halt, so they're gonna keep trading. Look for a bigger move on the warrants. Wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Here we go, here we go. Okay, game time warrants. Wow. 123. <coughs> 126, it's lagging. Gotta get hotted. Yeah, hot it, guys. But the hype didn't continue for long. After a few setbacks like the delaying of earnings, the declining popularity of Trump, and Google didn't approve the app for in the Play Store over moderation issues, blocking it from 40% of the smartphone market, bad articles of the Truth Social app spread, resulting in a decline in download rates. Listen up. It appears as if DWAC, aka Truth Social, aka former President Trump's social media play, is not having a good time. It's under serious pressure, and you could see that in the stock chart because it keeps going down and down and down, but now it might fall even more because there's a new federal criminal probe. Here's everything. So let's go ahead, let's look at the charts, let's see what the charts are trying to tell us. Now, on DWAC, of course, we had this massive spike back in October of last year. Huge move, it goes all the way up to $175, $180, that was the best that it ever did, okay? And ever since then, it's been on a trajectory to the point that where it's at today, and I don't think that the selling's over on this one. Now. With this one, you really just have to wait till some good news comes out and then try to play it. Right now, there's no no reason to play it right now, right? It's kind of just throwing money into a fire pit. Probably gonna lose, okay? Now, could you get a nice entry in there? Probably, but it's just not high probable. So I would just stay away from it until the news gets better. Apparently, the deal didn't go through. So September 8th, you'll probably have more news. I think that's on a Thursday. You'll probably have more news, probably saying it's done or something and the SPAC is gonna to have to liquidate and it'll probably be done with. And it's probably gonna go back down to $10 where SPACs usually flatline. So if that does happen where it is now at about $21, you could expect another ooh, over like 50% drop on it.